Oh, are they coming this way? Come on. Yeah! Got some coffee. We're gonna pull up anchor and cruise south some more, but first we're gonna dinghy all the way around pretty far to the other side of Long Island here on the bite side. Supposedly there's a big colony of wild flamingos over there. So we're gonna try to find them and then we're gonna go sail. You think we'll find the flamingos? We better find the flamingos. It's my only goal today. Our friends Connor and Steph, who you guys met the other day, already found them, so they gave us a little little heads up, a little pointer on, on where to go. Put the dinghy here in the water in a minute, and we'll get out of here. I would say I'm a pro of that. So not many people know that there's flamingos in the Bahamas. Would you say? I had no idea. Great Inagua, which is 80 miles south of here. Great Inagua has a ton of flamingos, and that's a place, if you do know there's flamingos in the Bahamas, that's a place that you probably know that they're there. But not many people know that there's flamingos here on Long Key as well. So I think generally when people think of Caribbean flamingos, they think of Aruba. Aruba's like the place where photographers go to get pictures of flamingos. Really? Aruba? And on the inside of Long Key is what they call the bite, something bite. I don't know, I forget the name. Ackland's bite. Ackland's bite maybe. And then if you go like way across the bite, if you go up north across the bite, you can get to Crooked Island. And if you go like straight east across the bite, that's all Ackland's Island. Just a little pit stop for Jetty. And now we're going. It's like maybe only four or five miles straight that way, but we gotta go around the tip and then back down, so it's gonna be like seven miles each way for us. Billy assured me we have enough fuel, so. Who's that way in the distance? We're gonna try to meet them there in Great Inagua in a few days. I think they're going straight there now. All right, we're on the bite side of Long Key, the east side, really shallow water over here. We've been seeing some sharks and rays as we dinghy by. And way up on the northern side of Long Key, on the bite side, they're all dead mangroves from Hurricane Joaquin, but it looks much greener down here. Oh, here's another section of dead mangroves and rock and stuff. What do you think you say? I found an island of flamingos! I'm so excited. I don't know if the camera is capturing it, but Sierra is ecstatic right now. <laughs> Try not to get too close right away. We'll sneak up on them slow. Don't want to spook them. Oh, I think we spooked them. They're all flying away. That was cool. Wow, so pretty. Our friends Connor and Steph must have saw the flamingos and they anchored out and came over. So we spooked them a little bit and they flew over there on the other side of us, but they're kind of sticking around still. This is so cool. They're so pretty, especially when they fly. So I, I wouldn't even really talk to Sierra. I was off flying the drone and she's trying to get some close up pictures of these guys, but I'm sure that her trip is just made because of this. Like who would expect flamingos in the Bahamas? Unreal. This is amazing. So this is kind of some of that destruction I was talking about from Hurricane Joaquin, like a lot of the vegetation, and it's even worse like in other parts of the area, but a lot of the vegetation is just dead. Too bad these Australian pines are here. Those are invasive, so it would have been nice that they got wiped out, but they're gonna probably take over now, unfortunately. You can see like the mangroves are all dead. Look at that guy. Osprey up there just looking over. 
the flock. Is that a good swim? She's like kicking off the bottom with her back legs. Oh, there you go. Nice and shallow. Oh, there's a couple more behind you. you guys <laughs> Before you guys go, before you go, hit the subscribe button. The, the, the subscribe, it just says subscribe right below this screen. And all of you that are already subscribed, thank you. Thank you. And there's a little bell there next to the subscribe. Hit that button too. Just hit the bell button. You get notifications if we post a new video, which Billy's been trying to post three times a week. Three so that's a lot of three videos. times a week. And last but not least, leave a comment. Let us know what you thought of this video. The flamingos were insane. Did you know there were flamingos in the Bahamas? I did right before we left because I follow like one of the Bahamas Facebook groups and someone posted a picture and that's when I showed you. I was like, there's flamingos here. We have to find them. And I didn't think we were actually going to get to that island, but we did. So, so we're excited. Cool. Well, thank you guys so much for watching as usual and we'll see you next time.